And welcome to the Manga Sensei channel, where every single day I, the Manga Sensei, break down the world's best language and the characters that go along with it. As you can already see on the screen, today we're talking about the symbol now, which is a very interesting symbol, and there's some de debate on how this symbol is actually written. But before we get into that, let's talk about how we read it. Now, this symbol is unique because it's written and read Kong and King. Kon is going to be a little bit more common than kin, but for the most part, what you're going to need to know this as is ima. Ima. Ima, as you see on the screen here, is the kun reading. And kun readings are words that are usually the Japanese native words that they have given to this particular symbol. So the native sound for this is ima, now, right now. Ima wa, ima. With that, though, let's talk about the etymology and how this sound, this word should actually be written. The first here in the etymology here is the counter for individuals, um, which looks like a up-pointing arrow. However, I disagree the fact that this here is being used, and if it's being used at all, it may be the symbol at the very, very bottom. However, more likely is that the symbol on the very top is a person jumping over one. So I see it as two people, like one person's kind of sideways. And right now, one person is jumping over another. And I think that is a lot more likely than the counter for individuals on top. Regardless, however, that you do see it is that you do see the picture and understand that the symbol means right now, this very moment and this very second right now. With that, let's look at some of the words, and some words here are very interesting. The first words of these words, now, for there are some kanji words, and there are also some jukugo. Jukugo are words that are happen when two kanji are combined. This is often where you see the own readings. The first one that I want you to point out is kyo. You now know both of these symbols. However, this is a unique word. This word and the second word, konnichiwa, are words that have the Japanese have taken from the language and put onto this, compa this compound of symbols. So when you see now and the word beside it for day or sun, what would that mean? That would mean, of course, today, this now's day. Kyo, kyo, kyo. Kyo wa ii nichi desu ne, ii hi desu ne, tenkin ga sugo ii desu ne, today. However, if this is followed with wa, now most often this is going to be written hiragana all by itself. Konnichiwa, konnichiwa, konnichiwa. Konnichiwa is probably the first word you learn in Japanese, which means hello. However, every once in a while, and particularly in the newspaper, you will see this symbol today with wa after it meaning konnichiwa. Lastly, we have kongetsu. 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 And you know this symbol as well. Now and then the symbol for the moon or month. This month. This moon. And that would give you this month, right? So we have now. This is a really, really fun symbol, and you're going to see it all the time, which is why I wanted to bring it up early on. As we continue talking about the JLPTN5 kanji, make sure to leave comments down below of what you think this symbol is made of. Do you think it's the symbol for counters, or do you think it's a person? With that, though, thank you so much for visiting and checking out this channel. I upload new videos every single day. I also do a podcast every single day where I break down Japanese grammar points. If you're interested in that, make sure to look in the show notes where I put down the links to that where we are the number one Japanese podcast on Spotify. With that, though, I will sign off. Thank you so much. And remember, after 10,000 mistakes, you become fluent. So, isho ni machigaimashou. Let's make mistakes together. With that, I'll see you tomorrow. Until then, jane.